Hey everyone, it's Belinda. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be talking about the Coins Auto Section Box plugin for Revit. The Coins Auto Section Box is probably one of the most downloaded and most popular apps in the Autodesk App Store. It's a free plugin, I'll link it in the description below. It claims to give you tremendous speed and agility over managing your three-dimensional views in your Revit model. This plugin helps you create either temporary or permanent views that you can use in your design process or even in your construction documents. The purpose of this plugin is to help you focus on your Revit model rather than spend time managing views and the views properties. I'm going to run through the download and installation process and I'm going to highlight all the main uses of this plugin. This is the Coins Auto Section box page on the Autodesk App Store. Once you hit the download button, you'll get an executable file. And when you run that, just select the version that you need depending on the version of Revit that you have. Once you install this, just go to any Revit file that you have and go to the Add-ins tab. You'll see the Coins Auto Section box uh, option right there. It's really easy to use this. Just select any object that you like, a wall, piece of equipment, furniture, etc. Then hit the Auto Section box button and once you do that, you'll get this pop-up dialog box. Just rename the 3D view. You can also change the buffer around the objects that you selected. And if you have a view template that you've set up, you can assign it over here, which saves you a step later. Once you hit OK, you see this 3D view is automatically created around the objects that you selected. This 3D view is saved in your project browser. One of the many features of this plugin is the ability to toggle your section box so you're able to see the location of your 3D view in relation to the rest of your project. You can turn off this toggle to go back to your original 3D view. Another feature is the ability to create the 3D views side by side to your original view. So I'm going to select these pieces of equipment and hit the auto section box. And at the very bottom, I'm going to select the option that allows me to arrange windows side by side. So this styles my original plan view with this new 3D view, so I'm able to analyze my Revit families better. So far, we've created 3D views with this plugin by just selecting pieces of equipment. You can also do it by creating a callout. So I'm going to go to view and create a callout around this boom. When I go to the coins auto section box add-in, I'm going to change the buffer to zero, so I'm only going to see this particular boom and nothing else and I'm just going to select the call out and hit finish and so my new 3d view is created of just the boom and the equipment on it and nothing else in addition to call outs you can also create 3d views by using a section tag just select the section tag and a 3d view is created of everything that would normally be in that section view Lastly, another feature that this Coins Auto Section Box plugin has is the ability to create quick auto sections. This saves your presets from the last time you use a command, so you don't have to specify the buffer or whether you want to tile the views or even the view template. So when I select the cabinets over here on the left wall and I hit finish, a 3D view is automatically created without me having to select options in the pop-up dialog box. Be careful about this though because it overwrites the last 3D view that you had and it doesn't create a new view. This quick auto section is really useful if you want to quickly analyze a model but you don't actually want to save the view. So to summarize, the main advantages of this plugin are the ability to create a 3D view through various methods, either plan, section, elevation, callouts, etc. You're also able to compare and contrast views immediately by tiling your 3D view next to your original view. You're also able to see the view in context to the rest of your model by using the toggle section box option. And finally, by using the quick section box option, you're able to save your presets and create views even faster. I found this plugin to be extremely useful and I use it on almost a daily basis now. When I'm working on a Revit model that's really large and really heavy, Creating elevations or sections can be very time consuming. So this plugin helps me quickly analyze a particular room three-dimensionally. Let me know what you think about this plugin in the comments below. 
Do you find it to be useful in your Revit models or do you think there's a better plugin out there that does everything this does and more? Subscribe to my channel if you'd like to watch more videos on automation and building construction. Until next time, I'm Belinda. Thanks for watching.